This is a tutorial to teach you how to turn on track changes in a Microsoft Word document so you can record your editing and have a second draft. First, open up your draft from your folder and then you're going to have to save it as a second document. Call the second document um, second draft. You can keep the, the name that you had the first time. It's important that you call it a second draft though because we're going to keep this as evidence of the revisions that you've made based on the feedback that you received. Once you've done that, click on Save and you now have a second copy of your document to work on. This is the copy that you'll make all the changes on. Now go up to the Tools and you're going to scroll down to Track Changes. Click on this and you'll see Highlight Changes and when you click on that you'll get a new text box that opens up. Click on the top box that says Track Changes while editing. Once you've done this, click on OK. You now are ready to start typing and your document will automatically track all of the changes you make. So if I type in my name, you'll see it's highlighted in a different colored text. This is so you know later on that this was a change to your second draft. You can insert comments, um, you can delete things, add things, take things out, move things around, and it will all be recorded by the uh, tracking changes in the document. So there I took something out and you get a little comment on the side that says deleted. Go through your entire document making changes as you go. Do this until you've finished with all of your revisions and then remember to save your work. Uh, the next step will be to save a third copy of this called Final Draft and in this one you'll go to accept all of the changes and get a final good copy.